Hi guys and welcome to the channel. So I've got another mystery box, um, this time from Zynga Entertainment. Um, so a friend of mine's given me a list to hunt down some pops for his daughter. Um, and one of the pops I found on Zynga at a good price. So I've purchased that pop, but I wanted to get a bit more out of my postage. So I've ordered six random mystery pops um, at 4 95 each. Um, so in this box, I'm expecting one pop in box number one, which is this one. So I shall open that one very carefully so I don't damage it. I'm expecting this to be um, a BTS pop, and it is indeed. So one for friend Dot. She's into this um, Korean pop group called BTS. So um, he asked me, can I track some down? And I have got one of the ones on his list. So that was the pop that we bought from Zinger. And um, like I say, to make the most of the postage, I decided I'd get some mystery pops. Now obviously, if I don't want any of these, they will be used on my vintage page. So we'll get the box out of the way and get into this mystery box. So say the box I did from um, Pop Culture Zilla was really good. Um, and I've had some success with these Zinger ones in the past so um, a little bit of fun I did enjoy doing the one from pop culture so um, I thought it was a good idea just to have a bit of a dabble with this so we'll see what's in it so pop number one okay pop number one is from Spider-Man No Way Home and um, we've got a special edition um, Ned. So Ned from No Way Home Special Edition. So No Way Home pops do tend to go really well. So please that one. I want to keep it, but not a bad one to start with. Um, again, another special edition Demon Slayer. Again, Demon Slayer pops have been going very, very, um, very well. So I've got Suzamaru. Uh, again, a Funko Special Edition, so quite a um, good one as well to get there. Uh, the next one is a Stranger Things one. We've got Henry 001. Uh, I did get one of these the other day. It was a Special Edition one, but not a bad pop there as well. So the next one is from Peaky Blinders. We have got Alfie Solomons. Um, I think that was the one played by Tom Hardy. So Alfie Solomons from Peaky Blinders. Uh, another Stranger Things Funko Pop. And this time I have got Nancy. That's not one I've already got one of. So um, another good one there in Nancy. And then finally, um, one I have got, I think, many, many times, and still trying to sell, we have got from Doctor Strange of the Multiverse of Madness, America Chavez. So all in all, not a bad box um, at all there. I will have a look and see what the value is, but each of these pops cost me £5 each. So I'm looking for £30 or above in value. Now, obviously, if they haven't got a value on TPD... I will just give them the £13 standard pop value, but we'll have a look and see how I did with this, um, what should I say, Zynga Multiverse um, 6 pop mystery box. So guys, I have checked the value of the box, um, it's like I say, it cost me £30, um, and I've got a bit of a return value of 76 um, should I sell them all at full price. The um, two stars of the box um, was Nancy. Uh, she's worth £17. And then the top hit on the box was Alfie Solomons. He's worth uh, £19. Uh, two pops had no value, which was Henry. Uh, so I'll give him a £13 value. And Suzamaru from Demon Slayer. Again, no value as yet on TPD. So again, £13 on that. Um, as I expected, the weakest pop in the box was American Chavez, only coming in at £5. Um, but um, Ned from Spider-Man Far From Home, 
gaming at £14. So I say you should get some really good value off of those pops um, selling them on. So I'm um, happy again with that. And again, really pleased with that. So it's well worth having a go on Zinger Entertainment for a mystery box. Um, but let me have a, let me know. Have you ever had a go on them? Um, what have you thought and what you um, found? But as I say, not too bad a box at all. Um, otherwise, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. I do appreciate every single one of you who does take the time to do so. But that's it from me today. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.